What's up, gamers? It's Kaiser holding it down now. How are we all doing tonight? This is going to be really interesting to see the run back of. I definitely won't be able to play Pikachu and Grands, guys. <laughs> um, that is not a matchup that's in the Kai repertoire. Now, I'm trying to work out like a good way to implement this. You know? But I haven't quite gotten it yet. I go like this. I'm trying to line up a bit better. But yeah, nothing seems to really click for this, unfortunately. So like, eh, not the biggest deal in the world, but it was something I wanted to put in. Anyway, we are getting started. These guys are sitting very far, like, away from each other on the setup. Obviously, muskets odds on here, but um, I want to see what a warmed up Brad can do. The, the big scrad daddy himself. Oh, no! Ah, oh, man. That's upsetting. <laughs> That's upsetting to see. If, if you're a Brad friend like me, I just don't want it. Back air? Yeah. You want to like do it early back air, do it early auto cancel back air, and then a, another auto cancel back air on the stage. I, I saw what Brad was going, Scratos was going for, but um, it just didn't count. Oh, that should do it actually. Yeah. Must get with the SCI all the way out as well. Probably just assisted in that kill. Oh, Brad just wants his shield grabs, but he's getting them. The thing about Musket is that you can never give... Like, sometimes... Oh! Brad! Okay, he lives to, he lives to tell another tale. Um, yeah, like... The thing about playing against Musket Fox is that some... Or any Fox, really, is that sometimes you just gotta shield grab him. Sometimes they're looking for that... That level 2 mix-up with the shine, when, when that's gonna come out. Oh, I like the angle from Brad. But Musket with the cleanest of coverages. Really nice for him, honestly. Oh. Unfortunate. But Brad might start trying to pull something out of the hat here. That'd be really good to see. Oh, Musket with the punish go. Go, 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 go. That's that. That's that. This Ready? Go. There we go. <laughs> Brad can do this. All right. He's actually started the stop pretty well. <coughs> now Musket's got him in the corner, but that was such a... Quite a reach on that shield grab, actually. It's all right. Musket's going to clean it up. 
What's up, everyone watching? If you want to chat, please hit us up with a follow. Alright, he just full hops. He full hops and he double jumps. The greatest fox tech known to man. I like the full hop Nair as well, actually. Uh, fox can cover a lot, especially catch really like big full hops out of shield from other foxes and falcos with a really early Nair. And Brett's starting to realize that. Tries to cover tech in place there. It would have covered two things, but uh, Musket chose the one thing that he didn't cover. Careful. Yeah, Musket's just not converting off of these shines on shields like he usually does. Usually when he gets a shine on shield, he feels very scared because he, uh, he's really like looking for that grab afterwards. And um, Oh, there we go. He's got some movement from Musket now. That's what you need in the Fox Theater. You actually need to play the movement. I like that drill from Musket as well. He's going to take the stock from like overshooting that. Musket's dash chance is actually starting to like develop into something beautiful. He's really only dashing away when he wants to. Say no to Fox. Say yes to Pikachu. I agree, Mark, but I don't think anyone else is going to be able to play it. Alright. Here we go. Brad's starting to get something happening. Instantly reverse. He missed up the follow-up there. See, I don't know. Musket, usually when he gets these opportunities at the ledge, he is double-shining people to infinity. And beyond, but Scrattle sends him to the moon. And FD is the pick from Musket. He's hoping his punishers are going to carry him here. And it's 1 1, so this is actually a nice time to pull it out. Shine? Oh, yep, yep. Keeping it simple, but Scrattle actually gets a slide off there, so he gets back. Oh, just both really reaching with these grabs. We've got some spot dodges. But Musket's still kind of coming out on top here, and he waits for the... Oh, no. Musket, I think maybe he's having some control issues, maybe. He seems really disappointed in how that turned out. He wanted a pivot up smash, obviously, but... Didn't happen for him. He's just really reaching for these grabs. Um, I'm not sure if... I'm not sure if Brad's going to do anything about it. Oh, just coming out from the ledge with an up air like that. I've noticed Musket do that a few times lately. And honestly, it catches a lot of people out. All right. Good damage for him so far. Scrattle just has not made, had a chance to really get anything started this game. It's all been the Musket show. And even when Musket's really just like whiffing and whiffing and whiffing, Brad's still not really getting much out of Musket flubs. Oh my god. You gotta make sure you're not like. You gotta make sure you have respectable follow ups, guys. When you get higher and higher in level, people know already how to get out of like the bread and butter combos. So you gotta get creative. Ugh. This is a rough Fox Sitter to watch. Yeah, nah, he, he's done with that one. Fair enough, brother. He knows that. Musket feels like he's in total control there. Also, this isn't losing semis anymore, if I'm not mistaken. This is actually losing finals. So the winner of this plays me and Grant. Musket wants it. Going to Battlefield here. A lot of full hopping coming out from Scarlet. I'm liking it. He wanted an up smash there, but he got it up there, unfortunately. Oh, he does wait like a good amount of time at the ledge there. Oh, but the Armada Shine from Musket's gonna do it. He's really clean on his edge guards now that the set's kind of progressed and the tournament's progressed. So you can't really be slipping when you're off stage against him or in the corner. Because look at this pressure. Brad's rolling. He's trying to jump out of shield. If he gets clipped by one of these shines, it's gonna be another star. So Brad's moving and starting to pick up. Now Musket's the rough one rolling and spot dodging. There it is. If Scrattle doesn't find a grab with these tech options that Musket's just spamming, he can turn it into something big. He's maintaining Santa. He gives it up a little bit to Musket. The one thing that I think Brad is really missing is really like fluid back and forth movement in this matchup. Being able to really just reactively move in relation to the other Fox is so important. 
Bosco obviously not making it easy. And just these little follow-ups that aren't really turning into it much as much as uh, what Musket's turning them into. To be fair, it's hard to play this Ditto in it, SA. Like, these two foxes are probably the the top end of the fox spectrum here at the moment. At least for solo mains. I mean, Musket's not a solo main anymore, really. He still does pop out the Peach. Ah! Oh, you cannot get greedy. He's gonna make it back. Oh, okay, he goes super low there. Ah, shine, bruh. <sighs> Yeah, I think uh, Scrattles doesn't want to win this one that badly. <laughs> yep. Whereas Musket has the eye of the tiger. Oh, nice. I like the Nair, actually. And he sets up for an edge guard with it. He doesn't clean it up, but I like what Musket's doing because he's using his advantages to, like, basically highlight his strengths. And that is cleaning up stocks on an edge guard. Okay. Okay, catches him out of shield. Didn't expect him to get hit there. Really fortunate for Musket. Oh, if he followed up with a shine after that, it could have been curtains for Scrattles. That said, Scrattles doing a lot better in these in this set than he was uh, in previous sets against Musket. Not only in the winners winners uh, racket set, but also in the previous tournament. But it's a bit rough. We'll see how well Scrattles can do next time these two meet. But that is it for his tournament life. He's going home with third. And it's time for the Beard Musket Grand Finals.